Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Finally getting to our 2020 or our 2021 Panini National Treasures Collegiate Football Break. Two box, pick your team at number six. This has been marinating on the site for a little bit, but now it is finally done. Thanks everybody for making this happen. There it is. We wrote pick your team six on there so we know they're all from the same case. Very big thanks to everybody who picked their team straight up. I appreciate that. And there's Alfonso with the Niners. Got them a little while ago. Thanks for your patience, everybody. Finally got the number blocks done. Big thanks to the people who uh, knocked out the number blocks with us. So that's the results there. So you get a block of numbers just for that set of teams and only for this break. Let's put that... And then here's a different set of teams. And we uploaded the, the uh, randomizer videos in separate videos if you want to take a look at that. Let's set those right there. And I'm going to help out the shipping team by, by post-it noting all of the, uh, the teams there. All right. Let's go. Good luck, everybody. All right, everybody, let's see what we got. So John Elway is gonna help us out here. We'll leave him on top right there. So behind him is a one out of five CD Lamb. Nice, a train whistle to start things off. And that is for the Cowboys who are a number block team. Out of fives and under, get the train whistle. So Dallas won is going to be for Josh. There you go, Josh S. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. C.D. Lamb has the distinction of, uh, well, maybe not the distinction. He, he may not be the only, he might be the. He's been fined um, about $50,000 or something like that already, which is a lot. And he's still only on that rookie contract, but it's a lot. I think he's been fined every week by the NFL for various violations. Some stuff like shirt untucked or something. I don't know, some random stuff like that. There's Trevor Lawrence and Travis Etienne, both Jaguars. That's uh, two out of 99. PJ picked up Jacksonville straight up. And a dual autograph, nice. That is Trey Sermon and Ramondre Stevenson. And that is 69 out of 99. And so that'll be a randomizer between uh, Trey Sermon, who's a niner, Alifonso, and Ramondre Stevenson at Patriot, which is a number block team, so New England 9. That'll be for Phil, so we'll do that at the end. And a book. We got 9 out of 25, Chris Evans. Two-color jersey, another relic there, and autograph. And Evans, according to the checklist, will, is a bangle. I think Michigan got, oh, there's, what's up, Justin? I think Michigan got their butts handed to them by Michigan State. I don't follow college too closely, but that did that was on my radar. I did see that.
Cincinnati, that'll be for David B. Picked up the bangle straight up. We got Anthony Schwartz, 6 out of 99. That is for Cleveland. That's going to go to Nathan. Picked up the Browns straight up. Cleveland, this is for you. David B., what's going on? And we got Kyle Trask, 93 out of 99, jersey and autograph. That is for the Buccaneers. Keith Kelly picked up the Bucks straight up. I've heard some people really like Kyle Trask. They think that he can marinate behind Brady for a season or two, learn a lot from, from the GOAT, and then maybe emerge as the future for Tampa Bay. And we got another book, 48 out of 49, Jalen Waddle. Nice, two books in this, Dual Relic and Autograph. 48 out of 49, going to Miami. And Miami was a number block team, part of that Jets number block group. So that'll go to Miami 8. And that's for Eric, Eric J. And of course, there's John Elway, 84 out of 99 for Denver, Patrick Davis with the Broncos. All right, nice. Second and final box, pick your team six. I don't think we have any more NT Collegiate, so big thanks to everybody who got into all of this NT Collegiate action on, on uh, jazbeescasebreaks.com. I appreciate it. We got World Series on in the background. It's been a pretty good game. I think a couple, uh, at least a few lead changes here. Redemption on the bottom. So it's been it's been pretty uh, it's been pretty entertaining. Um, Astros are up seven five now in the bottom of the six, but Braves are threatening. They've got a runner on. They've got Dansby Swanson up to bat. I think Jock Peterson up behind him. Jock can be pretty pretty clutch. Butts hands in probably a better description for Lions losing by 38 than Michigan losing by four to Michigan State. But, Mike, I think that Michigan was leading, weren't they? Leading by like 20-some-odd points, and they just wasted that lead away? I'm almost certain that that was the case. I would consider that Butts being handed. Well, now I have to look it up. Yeah, I'm pretty sure Michigan was up 23 to 14. I guess it wasn't that big of a lead, but they were up 23 to 14. And then they just let that one running back, yeah, add, allowed that running back to score like five touchdowns against them or something like that. They scored 15 points. Michigan scored 15 points in the fourth quarter to Michigan's three. So... I think that was the storyline. That was like the, the, the comeback. There's Deshaun Watson, 4 out of 25. As for the Eagles and Lions, I mean, I, I feel like, I feel like the, we knew that that was going to happen. Uh, Houston, Nick L. Maybe not by that scoreline, though. Although, I was saying that, I thought that Detroit was, 
was one of the best of the bad teams. <laughs> you know what I mean? But I guess not. 49 out of 99, Sage Surratt. Uh, Wake Forest is Sage Surratt. Sage Surratt is a lion, speaking of Detroit. And that will be for the New England number block group. So that goes Detroit 9. That's the other list over there. Phil with that one. Philip. 1 out of 99. Jalen Waddle, Miami 1. Josh. And we've got, ooh, a Joe Montana, 7 out of 10. That's pretty nice. I've heard of him. It's a little wrinkly on the penny sleeve here. Smooth that out a little bit. Nice. So, uh, well, I'm assuming, let's see what the checklist says. Yeah, Joe Montana, auto signatures and parallels. San Francisco 49ers. Last spot mojo, Alifonso with the Niners. Very nice. A few more to go here. We've got Sage Surratt again, 74 out of 99 for Nick. L uh, no, for the number block team. Check that. Lions. So it's Detroit 4. It'll be for Josh. Forty-five out of nine, uh, forty-nine, Diami Brown. And I think he is uh, part of the Washington football team. He is. And that'll be for Nathan Rossi. Picked up the uh, Washington football team straight up. We've got a Kellen Mond, 95 out of 99. Two-color jersey and on-card autograph. That's from Minnesota. Kellen Mond is a... Oh, the Minnesota's a number block team. Part of that New England group. That'll be Minnesota 5. And that'll be for that'll be for Taylor. And the last one's a redemption. So if it's uh, if it's a number block team, it'll go to zero. So it'll be either Josh or Josh or Taylor. And if it's a non-number block team, obviously it'll go to the team they're on right here. It's College of Materials Signatures Silver. Card forty four. J. A. Jamar Chase. Nice one for Cincinnati. That goes to David B. And the Bengals. And a free top loader. We're on to Cincinnati. There you go. Nice. All right, now a randomizer. It'll be between the Niners and New England. So we have to use uh, psychic science because ram.org is down, but here is Trey Sermon is a, uh, is a Niner. And Ramondre Stevenson is New England. I'm not sure what silver is number two, Justin. Um, we'll take a look after this break. All right, we gotta roll live dice. Two and a four, six times. One, two, three, four, five, 
and sixth and final time goes to Trey Sermon. His name's on top, so that'll be for Alifonso and the Niners. You get a dual autograph of the uh, former teammates going your way. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking with us, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. I'll see you next time for the next football break. Bye-bye.